we're actually about to head out though, so it was good seeing you. Yeah, though. good to see you too. James, what about the dog poop? Oh, it's okay, the rain will wash it away. Actually, that's the problem. When it rains, everything flows into our storm sewers, which then carry the waste directly into streams and water. But dog poop is natural, so what's the big deal? Well, actually, dog waste has a lot of different bacteria, like E. coli and tapeworms. Plus, we feed our dogs a really high protein diet to keep them healthy, and that's really acidic. All of that spells bad news for wildlife and people who live and play near our rivers and streams. That's not a big deal for my dog, because she's so little. It's not going to cause a big problem. In Franklin County, we have over 277,000 dogs. Collectively, they create over 104 tons of waste each day. So unless we all do our part, even the smallest dog can make a big difference. Wow, I didn't know any of that. What can I do to help? Well, first, you can actually make sure you always have a bag handy. I keep my bags in this convenient leash clip I got from the city's pup program. This sounds convenient. Where can I get one? Actually, if you sign up at columbus.gov slash pup, the city will send you one. You can also look out at the pup kiosk at Columbus Recreation and Parks Facilities as well. That sounds great. I'm definitely going to get one. Sounds good. Wow, thanks. Thanks. Come on, yeah. Remember, clean water is the goal, so pick up after your pup. And don't forget, register your dog at franklincountyauditor.com.